sensitive heart and mind would ever keep pricking the conscience of a person for the blessings he has been bestowed upon, while many others remain deprived. Every day, on my way to school, it just made me feel gripped with young children pushing beyond their physical strength at fruit and vegetable market. The miserable plight of these children forced them to awake at 3 a.m. before the morning sunshine when shivering with cold. The innocent children are at their job, devoid of peace and sweet dreams like many other children of their age. The developing limbs of innocent children were never designed to carry the heavy loads of life, but to move like green branches of the trees. Brushing past the air, a tender touch to the petals of the flowers and taking on them colors of the butterflies. It is poverty and hunger, coupled with ignorance and lack of awareness, that has been a source of trouble. An innovative young mind with a lot of dreams and aspirations would go wasted after spending the best early years of his life in search of a two-time meal. Abdul Rahman is one such child laborer and to his disadvantage he is blind too. The poverty at home has forced him to do some more work despite the fact that he cannot see. With clues of direction toward his destination at the market, he travels every day with his wooden cart and tries to earn a two-time meal. I find many such stories in my everyday local encounters. My aim of life is to find these people, to invoke in them a sense of ambition and to instigate the sense of responsibility in the minds of the people of Pa to build the nation as high as the Himalayas.